Hi, my name is Shay Schofield and I'm going to try and show you today how to tie your head pin around your bead so that you can put them on your bottle cap necklaces. So I'm going to get started today by showing you the tools that I'm using. Um, the first one is your round nose pliers. I've got my cutters to cut the head pin. And then I've got some, just some flat, flat tipped. Okay, I'm going to start with my, my bead here. I've already put it on my head pin. I, these little silver beads are a 3.2 millimeter. And then I've got my 8 millimeter bling. And then another silver bead up here. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to start with my, the round nose pliers. And I'm going to put this, make sure you can see it about this far up. Um, I'm looking to see if I can add another little bit more than another bead width here. Okay, make sure you can see that. And what I'm going to do is I've got my pliers turned sideways going this way. And what I'm going to do is I'm just going to turn my hand so that the top is going away from me. Okay? And then I'm just going to take my finger and bring it towards me and I'm curling it around and down so that what I'm left with is a little hoop here okay now I'm gonna take the pliers out and I'm gonna stick it back in I'm gonna stick it right through that hoop okay I'm gonna fold it all the way away from me okay and then I'm just gonna start wrapping it around this way, okay, three times, keeping it, see if you can see that, keeping it even, okay, don't let it point down or up, and then just wrapping it around, hold tight close so that it gets wrapped around, see if you can see that, it might look a little bit blurry. Just keep wrapping it around, keeping it horizontal until you get you get three. Let me see. My camera's doing this a little bit blurry here. Let me see if I can get it. I don't know if you can see that or not. Then what I'm gonna do is just clip this extra off with my cutters. And then I'm gonna take my little flat nosed and I'm just going to crimp that down. Push the end down so that it's not sticking out. And then I can kind of adjust this up top and get it the way that I want it. And there you have it. It's done and it's ready to put on. Takes a little practice. But I think it looks very nice. Thanks for watching.